The final race of the week then is the Leadham Stakes. It's a 10 furlong maiden race. And still is inquiry here. Mr Clutterbuck gets a cup. Tim Sandyman gets a handicap. And all I get's a poxy old maiden. Well, a 10 furlong two-year-old maiden at that. that anyway. Arthur Guinness is at the top for Paul Rhodes. Comedian for Dan Hughes. Hunting down Martin Leadham. Money for nothing. Patrick Hogan. Smart Weasel. Adam Old Cranberries. For Derek Hinton, Grace under fire, Obi Wan, half a more pants for David Robertson and Lee Hu Mossa for Dan Hughes, a field of nine in this final race of the week. Royal Ascot next week, polish your top hats, ready for that. Then it'll be Christmas, and that don't make sense, does it anyway? They're away and racing, and a lot of greys in this, four of them, I think. And money for nothing is one of the first to show, but now Grace under fire has come through to take it up. For Obi Wan. So Grace under fire in the lead, then from Cranberries in second, and a gap of two or three lengths back to Money for Nothing in third. Carmelian is after that one, those three Grace racing together. Hunting down is just the back marker at this point, but it's Grace under fire in the lead from Cranberries in second, then Money for Nothing is back in third. Carmelian and Lee Mosser, and then half a more pants is after that one. Smart Weasel hunting down, and finally Arthur Guinness just about the back marker but they're coming down towards the six furlong point and it's grace under fire who is two lengths clear of the hard held cranberries in second gap of four lengths then to money for nothing in third and chameleons after that lee who mossa next in hunting down half more pants arthur guinness and finally smart weasel the back marker then so four and a half to go and grace under fire continues to lead cranberries is second money for nothing is in third lee who mossa is next then comes hunting down then trying to be driven up the inside was arthur guinness half more pants is there as well smart weasel is still the tail end charlie but it's grace under fire who's the leader by two lengths to cranberries in second money for nothing is third the one that's Cruises up the inside is Lee Humosa. Hunting down, starting to make a bit of a run. Then comes half a more pants after that one and a bit of a gap to the back three. We're struggling. Chameleon, Arthur Guinness and Smart Weasel. There's still two furlongs to go. And it's just about Grace under fire. But Lee Humosa and Cranberries now go on. Money for nothing's back in third. Hunting down, he's back in fifth. Running on there is Chameleon, but his stable mate Lee Humosa is clearing the lead well inside the final furlong. Jockey has a look around. He's absolutely no dangers whatsoever. And Lee Humosa takes this one pretty cosily easy win for Lee Umos it's close for second Cranberry's just hanging on from money for nothing Huntingdale was third fourth sorry and then all the way back to Smart Weasel who was the last one to finish Dan Hughes takes the final race of the week in pretty spectacular style winning that one cosily losing his maiden certificate before next week's Royal Ascot meeting and Lee Humosa is the winner for Dan Hughes. Crumbridge second for Derek Hinton. Money for nothing. Padre Hogan was third. Huntingdale for Martin Lillian was fourth. Chameleon for Dan Hughes was fifth. And we'll be back next week for Royal Ascot. Top hats at the ready.